Rasulullah sallallahu even after Islam, yes, can a Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam basaman, duhakan, the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam was smiling and laughing, the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam was gentle, and Aisha radiallahu ta'ala anha, she says, وَمَنْ تَقَمَنِ نَفْسِهِ قَطْ I never once saw the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam become angry for himself, but you know what? She said, when the boundaries of Allah were crossed, he would become more angry than anyone else. وَيَنْتَقِمُ لِلَّهِ He would become angry for Allah. The Prophet ﷺ would not become unethical. The Prophet ﷺ in his anger would not curse. The Prophet ﷺ in his anger would not insult anyone. But the Prophet ﷺ would take a firm stance against injustice. Whether it was in the form of Bilal radiallahu ta'ala anhu coming to the Prophet ﷺ and complaining that that, that Abu Dhar radiallahu anhu insulted him. Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa didn't take that lightly. He went to Abu Dhar radiallahu anhu and he admonished him. Or it was in the form of Khadija radiallahu ta'ala anha being insulted. The Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa got mad for Khadija radiallahu ta'ala anha. Or it was in the form of a group of people being transgressed or having their rights taken away from them, the Prophet ﷺ got angry. And you know what? So did Jesus alayhi salam. Isa alayhi salam was not a passive man. And subhanAllah Azza wa he refutes this idea of Isa alayhi salam in the Quran. قَالَ إِنِّي عَبْدُ اللَّهِ آتَانِيَ الْكِتَابَ وَجَعَلَنِي نَبِيًّا وَجَعَلَنِي مُبَارَكًا أَيْنَ مَا كُنْتُ The first words of Isa alayhi salam when he spoke from the cradle were what? إِنِّي عَبْدُ اللَّهِ I am the servant of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Atani al kitab. Allah gave me a book and He made me a prophet. Wajalani mubarakan aynama kunt. And Allah made me blessed wherever I may be. Ibn Abbas radiallahu ta'ala anhu he says, Mubarakan aynama kunt. To be blessed wherever I may be means bil amr bil ma'roof wa nahi an al munkar. That wherever Isa alayhi salam went, he enjoined good and he forbade evil. Awsani bil salati wa zakati ma dumtu hayya. He enjoined me with prayer and with charity. Ma dumtu hayya, as long as I am alive and I am not shy about demanding that from people. Isa alayhi salam, the image of Isa alayhi salam, that Isa alayhi salam was just someone that walked the streets gently and just smiled at people and just said, it's okay, keep doing your injustices, keep wronging people. Just believe in me as the Son of God. This is a flawed image. It contradicts even the image of Isa alayhi salam in the Bible. Isa alayhi salam, when he walks in the temple and he sees people cheating in the temple, what does he do? He flips tables. That's biblical. He flips tables. They hated him because Isa alayhi salam was such a strong voice. You know, he was seen as a political threat as well as a threat to their theology. Isa alayhi salam called them out on their religious hierarchies. He called them out. That's not the Christianity of Isa alayhi salam. It's not the Islam of Isa alayhi salam. The Islam of Isa who is described as a rahmah for the world, as a mercy to the world. The Islam of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam who is described, وَمَا أَرْسَلْنَاكَ إِلَّا رَحْمَةً لِلْعَالَمِينَ We have not sent you except as a mercy to all the worlds. Was an Islam that rectifies the affairs not only of the self or the family or the community, but of the world around them. It's an Islam that addresses all of these issues. It's an Islam that demands one to change his own self as well as his society.